Hey guys, Stuck on Collectibles. My name is Brian. We're back again for another video. This time we're going to do the first haul of 2024. It's not a big haul, mind you. And I got to excuse myself for a second to pick up a piece. Not being prepared. But uh, it's a small haul, uh, mostly from Ross's and Ollie's. I have not seen anything in our Target on clearance that I want, which they didn't have much clearance when I got there. I went there three times. I went to two different Targets afterwards, and there was nothing left on clearance. Nothing. Went to Walmart. Nothing. Uh, it's just an Ollie's. I went there for the 33% off, and... Anything they had left, which was mostly from Marvel Legends, Eternals, some Doctor Strange, uh, Black Series, they had the Archive, Wave, nothing there that I wanted that I don't already have. I might bite the bullet and buy it just to complete the Eternals down the road. I mean, they have just about every one there, except for the exclusive one. Uh, they have most of the Doctor Strange waves. Uh, the only one I wanted was sleepwalker and I kept passing and passing on him and I haven't seen him so I'm sure if I go to another Ollie's he'll probably be there but uh, yeah let's start with the comic book first this was an Ollie's pickup it's a heavy book uh, this is Batman Nightfall volume 3 Night Send I thought I would give that a read I don't read a lot of Batman by himself but uh, besides that book, oh yeah. And, I mean, I, I enjoy Batman, don't get me wrong. But uh, I'm mostly into team books. So, but uh, like Justice League, stuff like that. But for, for like six bucks, yeah, I needed something to read. So, probably going to start today. Tell you the truth, I got afternoon where I'm not doing anything after I'm done filming a couple of videos and that'll probably be my thing to do now I know a lot of people aren't into these figures I'm uh, buying these basically for the card thing and I screwed this one up sticker stuck to it and ripped a little bit of the card which that's eh, okay but these are the Marvel 3.75s we found Nova And for three bucks, absolutely, absolutely. I mean, it's going to stay on the card. Uh, not going to do anything with it. Now this one, I'd be tempted if I actually found an Iceman and a Spider-Man. But we got Firestar. Now these are at Ross's for like three bucks, two ninety nine, something like that. So, yeah, cards are in perfect shape except for the Nova where the sticker was. And... The, when I was talking to the lady the other day, she said they're going to continue getting this stuff all the time. So, because I was asking about the other things, which is coming next, and she goes, "Oh yeah," she goes, they, "They're they're being told that they're going to continue getting stuff." So, let's do this in order here. We got GI Joe Classifieds forty four. We got Tomax. No, I haven't even sat back and looked at the back to see if there's anything new on the back. Doesn't look like it. I don't know why they're teasing people with the vehicles. I mean, we want the vehicles. At least I do. I just couldn't afford to hiss at the time. So, maybe down the road. Well, you can't have two Max without like Zaymod. Here's 45 Zaymod. I mean, I got them separately. They weren't there together. I mean, one Rosses had two Max, one had Zaymot. So, that was the small haul. Sorry. But, yeah, for the first haul of the year, I'm not complaining. Uh, except for the sticker thing. And it was the only one they had of him, so. 
Not that I'd return it. That'd be a waste of time. I mean, there's still some sticker on there, but I'm afraid to peel any more off because of this towel ripped. But that's okay. I mean, I'll keep getting these when they're that price. I mean, if they keep getting new ones. I'm surprised Ollie's didn't get anything. Super 7 would learn a trick or two from these. I mean, these were originally, what, like uh, 10 bucks in the regular store? Super 7 would lower theirs to 10 bucks. They would sell, but they won't. They're paying for the licenses. Because I'd buy the G.I. Joe, the Transformers, the Thundercats, a couple other ones, but I'm not paying 20 bucks a piece. I did have, got a few of Thundercats, and I did buy a few in the past over at Second of Charles, but that was about it. But, hey, we're at 41 subs right now at the time of this video being filmed. We're trying to get to uh, 100, where we're going to do a pretty good giveaway. So, tell me what you thought of the haul. Give me a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs down. Leave a comment. Um, tell me what you think. I mean, the G.I. Joe were $5.99. I know there's some people out there go, oh, why are you waiting to buy them cheap? Uh, technically, i never seen these at our Target or Walmart. Right now, our Target has zero Joes. None. Uh, in our area. And uh, our Walmart has, has shipwrecked for months. Then they got Lady J and Baroness on the cards. That's all I've seen. Nothing else. If you stay in our area. Now, I don't go too far anymore because just time... I mean, we live out in the boonies now. So, until I can get time to go someplace, I'm stuck with what I got. I mean, I can go to two different Walmarts. I got a Target, Ross, Marshalls, Five Below, which they haven't had anything but Pops lately. And I'm pretty much done with Pops, except for a few. I'm thinking about getting the G.I. Joe set. Other than that, maybe the Transformers set. And... Not going back into the Star Wars, the Marvel, the DC, or anything like that. I got a few, I don't know if you can see them or not, over here that I kept because they were gifts. But other than that, that's it. But thanks for tuning in. Pass the word along. We're going to try to do a video each week, and we don't edit, so if your phone rings like the last video, I'm sorry. And um, we're going to go from there. Have a good one.